Hello everyone. This is CCNA version 6, Bridging Course Packet Tracer Activity 1236. The objective of this packet tracer activity is to troubleshoot and resolve connectivity issues. This is our topology. Users are reporting that they cannot access the web server, so we'll check that. First, we check PC1. Try to access web server using IP address. It's request timeout. And we'll check the IP address of this PC. You see, the second octet of the IP address isn't match with the default gateway, so we'll fix this and try again. It's work. Now PC1 can access web server using IP address. And we'll try using the domain name. Okay. We have resolved the problem of PC1. Now we'll check PC2. PC2 cannot access web server using IP address, now we'll check the IP address. As you see, the default gateway is wrong, the last octet must be 1, not 11. Fix this and try again. Okay then, the problem is resolved. Now we'll check PCA. PCA cannot access web server using IP address. The IP address is correct. All link light is on, so the problem may be on the interface of the router. We'll check this. The connection is resolved on PC1 and PC2, so we access the router via SSH on PC1 or PC2.
Use the command, show IP interface brief to show IP information of all interfaces. You can see, the IP address of interface G01 is wrong, fix this and try again. OK, PCA can access web server now. And the last one is PCB. We can access web server using IP address, but when using domain name, it's returned host name unresolved. So, the problem is the PCB cannot connect to DNS server or the DNS server is not working. We'll check the connection between the PCB and DNS server. The connection is fine, so the problem is on the DNS server. We'll change DNS server and try again. OK then, it's work now. All PC can access the web server using domain name. And we got 100%. Thank you for watching.